Okay, this is the first time I'm trying to get a recording done on my FHD monitor for my laptop. I don't know if it's going to work. I want to cover a vast ignorance and arrogance in Christianity that claims you're supposed to ask for forgiveness. It's the same kind of stupidity that um, Donald Trump uses when he says he doesn't ask for forgiveness and then everybody gets mad at him because he doesn't ask. You're not supposed to ask. You're claiming a promise. And I want to show you how you can tell that that's true right here in Scripture where the so-called, but not really, Lord's Prayer is used. That people repeat. That's not what God is doing here. I'm so sick of Christian disgusting apostasy I could die. We're going to be electing a really bad president no matter what we choose because of this. Okay? So you learn it. Do not be like them. Unfortunately, I have to use Bible Works 9. I hate this version. Okay, do not be like them. Your father knows what you need before you ask him. Okay? That's when you're asking for things that you want when you don't know. All right, but that's not what's used here about so-called debts, which is not asking for forgiveness for sins. It's about debts. It's about what we owe. I'm so sick of Christians being hating the Word of God and not looking it up that I could just die. Okay, look at this. You see this word here? It's translated forgive, it's afiemi, it means to cancel a gambling debt. And it's usually translated forgive. Now take a real hard look. It's in the imperative mood. Imperative. That's not asking. That's asserting. You are claiming a promise that you will be given, you will be forgiven because Christ is going to pay on the cross. You name your sin to God. This isn't even about sin. This is forgive us what we owe somebody else for what we did wrong to them. And it's not even an asking. It's an imperative mood. It's called the imperative of entreaty. You are claiming a court case. That's what 1 John 1 9 is after the fact. But this is in the book of Matthew where Christ is talking before he's gone to the cross. He's saying, hi, it's a it, it's like going to the bank and taking and, and demanding your deposit be, you know, given you. Okay, it's in the imperative mood. It means it's something for sure that God did or was gonna do. You are claiming as a contract provision. It's not asking. You're claiming a promise that God made. Now, if you don't know that, then you are carnal. You will not be in fellowship with God. If you think you have to ask God for forgiveness, which is a Catholic lie, then you're carnal and you can't read the Bible. Got that? so sick of Christians I could 